Yeah, I ran for miles and look what I've got. I've got some new shoes. So these are the boots I was meant to take me to Berlin, right? I told you, I went, I came back from Berlin. I went to Bergheim. I went to Grace Müller. I went to all these amazing, crazy places in Berlin. Hang out with some cool people. Shout out to my friend um, Haley Oxlade. I hanged out with her and a few other people that I know from the East London scene. So she works at this amazing pub called The Dwarf. I recommend you check it out there. Um, really cool little place. Um, so hanging out with them, everything was great. But I was meant to take my boots with me. I wanted to take these amazing boots. I wanted to go there and style like, a style on them. I wanted to go there and look like a fucking Vetema model, model, right? That's what I wanted to do. But unfortunately, the person who I bought this flipping stuff off of, right, didn't ship them in time, right? There's a picture here, actually, I want to show you that I wanted to kind of... This is the look I was going for, right? Let me see if I can find this picture. This is from the... Um, the um vetema instagram profile right they have right here so let me see if i can find it here somewhere they took a picture of a guy standing outside um the Bergheim. let me see if i can find it here oh that jacket is incredible isn't it? what collection is that from oh that puffer jacket is really nice not mad at that jacket at all i love the fact they've got a lot of plaid in their things isn't it oh yeah okay so number one these are th these boots are basically what they're what i've i kind of sort of bought the uh, the original of right these amazing bondage boots they look fucking nuts they look so bloody crazy it's not it's not even fair but unfortunately they don't come in men's size i don't think these ones do i think these are the women's the ones with the two straps at the top and the ones at the front and the ones here on the side here might come as in men so they kind of remind me of the boots that i have right so if you're kind of thinking why what i was talking about here they are let me save that and put that in my thing but let me scroll down and find the guy there's a dude here that had a picture where there was a server and was like oh no they can tap it. it's in front of the burger and where see if i can find it scroll 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 it's on their profile yeah there we go so this look i was going for right when i, when I went to burger i wanted to look at this so this is model if you were listening to the podcast app there's a picture here of a vetima uh, model or of one of the people that they kind of scout from their social feed i think people just tag their tag pictures of themselves wearing vetima and then i think for the most part if they live in europe or live in cool places some of their photographers or stylists would go out to them and do kind of and you know a photo shoot but they've got this kid standing in front of the Bergheim wearing a massive oversized hoodie, big trousers, a kind of cable, uh, kind of wallet chain, the better more spiked sunglasses. He's got this weird sort of keyboard thing hanging on the side of his on the side of his waist, which will actually double up as a quite a good um pouch. You know, if someone's able to do that, like a pouch that look like a keyboard, that would look quite cool. Um and he's got these make these big boots on, right? But you can't see what exactly they are. So that was my kind of look that I was trying to go for when I went to Berlin. But I didn't have my boots in time. If you're wondering what boots I'm talking about, it's these New Rock bad boys. So I've got these New Rock boots here. I'll show you. Ugh, so heavy. So these are the ones I bought, right? I bought it from eBay. Amazing New Rock boots. They've been used, of course, but they're still in great condition. I only bought, I think they only came up to about £50, so great deal. Um, they all kind of like, they all kind of detached here on the side here of Velcro, and you can kind of tighten them up from there. And they're super heavy, as you can see from me lifting them up. They're massive, thick soles, and they just fit my style completely. So, unfortunately, I won't be able to wear them for Berlin because I'm, you know, back home now. So you've got the whole New Rock stuff on there as well. You got the whole boots there. Like they, they just look, they just look nutty. I absolutely love these boots. I hope you can see them. Can you see those? They just look super, super nutty, man. Look, look, look how big they. Look how big they are. Look at that. Look at that. Look how big they are. They are massive. I kind of fit in a screen of the thing I'm, 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 I'm using right now. They don't fit at all. But yeah, these are the boots I went to use. But unfortunately, you know, they didn't. I didn't. I didn't get them in time. But yeah, amazing boots. Look at the back as well. Super, super cool. Um. So now I'm gonna have to wear them for fold when I go to fold because I, I I bought my tickets to go to see um the Indivisions party that I mentioned the other day. So if you guys are um you know on the fence and not deciding where to go i recommend you go and check that out i actually bought my tickets just now but these boots are fucking amazing and will go really well with what i'm wearing and this this is basically my my swag or my style for the season um these sort of boots especially for the winter i'm going to get some nice big leather trousers i'm going to get a nice leather trench coat kind of full-on matrix vibes and if i want to wear some other stuff i'll probably have some rick owens pants that i have and inter intermingle some stuff with it and then the other thing that i'm thinking of getting especially for the winter if you're thinking about if you're wondering what kind of shoes I want to buy, there's this new Rick Owens. Um, see if I can find them. Rick Owens, Dark Shadow, right? It's all, it's all Dark Shadow stuff, I think. Let's see if I can find it. It's a Rick Owens shoes. Which I can find it. Which one is it? This I can find. It's like a Rick Owens um, shoes, but it's stacked sole. Again, I know I, I'm going. I'm going ham with the stacked sole, and I'm not really caring right now. But I think these stacked sole shoes look fucking banging. Probably one of the best things out I've seen in a while. Right. See if I can find them on here for you guys to see. It's got Rick Owens' man here. Mm -mm -mm. 
Said menu, see refine. Mm -hmm. Let's scroll down to dark shadow. I'm pretty sure it's a dark shadow shoes. They're essentially the the same. What are they called? Um, what the what the fucking um the but not the geo baskets. What are they called? Uh, see, I can find them. There's a Rico and shoe that's now double stacked. So it's basically this but stacked. Right, so I think these are my winter shoes I'm gonna go for. So yeah, there we go. We're going shoes with a double sole on them, right? So they're coming. So yeah, there's not many sizes left actually. Only my size there on the 44. But yeah, double sole, uh, bumper shoes or Larry double bumper shoes. I don't know what they call, but yeah, they look fucking banging, don't they? What, what do you guys think? So that's my basically um, idea of what I want to wear for um, winter coming up. Um, double sole shoes all the way. So so something like this, or then the Rick Owens shoes. I mean something like this. The we go in uh, double stack shoes and then obviously my new rock boots but yeah i'm i'm guided in coming time and i think these will look would have looked so good on me at berlin imagine wearing this with my vetamar hoodies and all my big trousers and shit it would look so incredible these look really cool some leather pants actually imagine some you know some chrome hearts leather pants will look fucking banging with these i probably might have to get some vintage ones because chrome hearts might be a bit outside of my budget but i'll get i'll, I'll see what i can do but yeah lovely boots got them got them both yesterday yeah well do you have the other day finally picked them i was able to pick them up because Parcel force were rubbish with getting stuff sent to you at the right time. But yeah, these are both of them. Look, they're so heavy. I mean, dragging them, literally dragging them up. <laughs> you could probably do a workout with these two. Like, they're fucking massive. Look how blonde they are. Look at that. They're fucking wham. <laughs> but yeah, can't wait to wear them and get them out there and be one of the first people on social wearing them properly, right? Set trends, mate, because I'm an influencer. Influencer. <sighs> All right, so that's my update for my stuff. Let's get into some topics. First on the list here, we have Man United will stick with Ole Gunnar 